toys or kids work, that that's what they do. Kids just really like toys. I'm the director of Wood to Wonderful. That's the boy. Now you're cooking. Which means I get to clean everything up. <laughs> All in favor of pizza and spaghetti, raise your hands. All right. Motion carry. That's good. All right. Okay, Maddie, you and I are going to work on this. Let me get you closer to me. Our goal is to make as many wooden toys as we can for as many children in need as we can reach. Robert, you know where these are going, don't you? In uh, Ukraine. To Ukraine, yeah. We heard that in Ukraine, there is nothing being sent for babies in the way of toys. So the only thing babies can really use are rattles. I heard on the radio that the first month of the war, there were 5,000 babies born. And these babies have no rattles or any toys of, of any sort that they can play. It's such a joy. It's, it's again, it's a volunteer work, um, which I know is hard to get volunteers nowadays. And it's just so easy to get up in the morning and come in here a couple times a week. I don't know. Why do we do that, Louise? <laughs> I don't know why we do it. We just do it. It's just something that we do. Okay, buddy boy. It's so easy to wake up in the morning knowing that I'm coming in to do something, make a difference. Make sure you hold that. Working with these wonderful people, and it's, it's, so, it's so rewarding. It's, I can't imagine anything else. I would guess we make over 10,000 toys a year. We've been in Reading. This is our 26th year here. You know, Louise and I are both up in years, and rather than sitting at home doing nothing, coming here doing something is, I think, much nicer. It's, uh, there's no pressure on numbers or quantity of anything. Uh, it's it's a good time. That's true. Wooden toys are today unique. Years ago, they weren't unique. Uh, in order for children to play with our toys, they have to use their imagination. If they don't use their imagination, the toy has no meaning. They have to make the sound of the car or the helicopter or um, the mouse or whatever toy it is that we give them. They have to use their imagination to bring it to life. There are no batteries, there are no plastic pieces. So if you added all the years up, there would be hundreds of thousands of toys that we've made. We just hope that the children that get them enjoy them. I mean, that's the, that's the reason that we do it. That's what goes through my mind, that I want to do a good job more than anything to make sure that this kid, they, that's all they have.